live this is one for the record I will be showing you some things that I ran across earlier today this was one of them the money in your account was stolen this morning I did run a video look on my recent uploads that's like a follow-up thing talking about uh, how the FDIC works here's this article from Dave Hodges Okay. So, heads up on this. Russell Napier is declaring November 16th as the day money dies. Wow. Alrighty then. Heads up on this. Moving on. This has to do with an, some type of breaking nuclear event. Redcon 5, urgent 2,729 CPM. I'm going to attach the whole video on my recent upload so you can watch this. Coming out of the Watchman Report 2127. Wow. So, but just stay tuned. I'm going to attach this. It should be after my video, the whole this whole video of what he's saying. But we're going to go over and look at the uh, the nuclear uh, chart here. Stand by. I came across this over here. This can't be normal. Four hundred and eighty-one CPM. Bakersfield, California. Current four hundred eighty-one. And the low is normally 12. The high, 1802. The average is 160. This is not good. A beta particles. All right, heads up on this one. Let's go see if there's something else on this chart. I don't see the uh, Chicago, Illinois one. This is the emergency uh, nuclear emergency tracking center. What's this one? Okay, this one is uh, CPM, current 62, low 4, high is 124. Okay, there's the time here. I don't see the other one, though. Let's keep looking for it. It looks like it's off the chart now. What's this one? Oh, it's changed. Oh, here's another one. Hold on, let me move this. Here's another one. Okay, this one, current 21, low is 3, high is 40. Average over the last 10 minutes. Here's the time, the date. going on in here maybe that thing's hidden in here no looks like it's not happening now though but still this one here that's too high 480 hmm alrighty then moving on Max stop we'll go for a walk and then we'll continue Here's another one, 503 CPM, hidden behind all this stuff here. 503 counts per minute. The highest, 2,188. Average is 288 over here. In Arkansas, heads up over there. What is all that? Look at the high radiation. What's going? What's really going on? 
Here's another one, 153 counts per minute. High is 513, low 11. Current is 153 counts. I remember when it got over 100, that was like an alert originally. Here we go. Here's the chart. Wow. And that's concern watch when you see like it's a darker color. I think it's all a concern. Alrighty then. Moving on. Now this is a picture I took on 11-16-2014 in Central Florida. Look at the sky. Look at the chemtrails. This is right before um, the, uh, the next day on Monday the cold, cold started coming in. Look at all this. This even looked like a Z. And the planes just kept putting the chemtrails, putting the chemtrails in the sky. And there were birds that were flying in like this direction, going in a circle. Because And they wouldn't land, I think, because of this. And they didn't go past the barrier of these chemtrails. It was like a whole flock of birds. So this is what I took pictures of myself in the sky over Florida on 11-16-2014 check it out this is another view of the same picture another view of the same picture in the sky on 11-16-2014 Intense cam trailing right before the weather changed here. Wow. Now it's very cold for us. Live. This is one for the record. I'm Diane, and today, today is November 18th, 2014. Here are your news updates for today. It's way late in the middle of the night. All internet went down in my area, <laughs> and it's cold. It's very cold. <laughs> Alrighty then. Oof. I am. I'm going to um, edit in some stuff that I saw also on the internet, so hopefully it'll work out. <laughs> All right, here we go. November 18th, before it's news. Dot com. Ebola woman drops dead in New York, bleeding from nose and mouth. Ebola can come on very fast without the usual fever and other symptoms. Renowned infectious disease expert Michael Osterholm recently had some frightening things to say at a Ebola symposium at John Hopkins. Wow. But I guess Ebola can just come on up just just very quick and, and and kill someone. The Daily Mail is reporting that New York Fire Department activated the special operations and hazmat units after the woman who had traveled to Guinea three weeks ago, according to a source on the scene, died at Amy Professional African hair braiding in the Brownsville area of Brooklyn 
Heads up, I believe I have some subscribers there. Susan Ortiz. I don't know if you know where that place is. Stay away from that place. Alrighty then. Let's see what else it says about this. So, heads up, Susan Ortiz. An eyewitness who saw the body said that there was blood coming from her face, nose, and mouth. Who? Alrighty. She was at the salon visiting the owner and was said to have died of a heart attack, said the, s the same worker. An Ebola test will be run on her remains out of an abundance of caution and results will be available by Wednesday morning. Heads up. Heads up. Professional African hair braiding in the Brownsville area of Brooklyn. Stay away from there. Right now, just stay away from there. Also, t also, Toyota to lose $100,000 on every hydrogen FCB sold. They're coming out with a new car that runs on uh, hydrogen, so heads up on that. Hmm. Let's see what else I saw in here. And then I'll move on. Oh, it's cold. Very late. Actually, it's the, the 19th early in the morning. Let's see. You're being watched online via your webcam. Heads up, even if it's not on, they're probably watching you. Alrighty then. Nibiru is now perihelium to our sun. The trumpets will soon begin. Wow. Uh -oh. Here we go. Keep your eyes open. Keep your eyes to the sky. Okay, moving on. Let's see. We'll get rid of this. I don't know. I hope the internet doesn't go down again. Just close this window. There we go. We're here. All right. I'm gonna make this kind of short because I'm attaching a whole bunch of stuff and editing it in. <laughs> Let's go to E E News, Energy News, <coughs> U.S. Canada. West Coast scientists: Many animals on seafloor are looking sick or dead. Everything's dying. Dead, 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 and dead. Experts investigate what's killing sea urchins and cucumbers in Pacific Northwest, seeing things never previously observed. Also, today, experts seemingly benign virus on West Coast causing ecological upheaval, the likes of which we've never seen. Very particular, different from all known viruses. Mutations could be helping it spread. Something may have recently caused it to go rogue. We've never seen anything like this. Why now? What, what changed to allow outbreak? These people are so incompetent and it's maddening in the way they talk. It's just idiocy. This person, obviously, this expert must be uh, incompetent. By now, they should figure it out that most of us know what's going on with the with the West Coast, and still they're going to play a game. 
some strange game and we don't know what it is. It's the first time we ever seen it and we don't know what's going on. Well, maybe they should take a swim in there and then they'll figure it out. Patented explosives reported in patented patented they have a patent on it explosive reported inside plutonium waste drums at US nuclear facility TV so volatile experts comparing it to bomb officials I'm appalled we weren't told about real and present danger over 5,000 drums a threat invisible reactions may have already occurred and there's a video this was yesterday also yesterday US government uranium plant leak warranted emergency classification of alert worker video shows release was out of control smoke billowing they refused to warn community TV I lived here 30 years and never seen anything like it I was shocked it's ridiculous it's not contained everybody watched it <laughs> I have some reports on some of that I think I, I believe that's by Honeywell so heads up I'm gonna attach some videos it's so late I'm trying to stay awake all right take care be prepared for anything and I'll see you tomorrow on the flip side I'm still working on getting a live show together and trying to plan it and then maybe people can Skype in and I can somehow sp split the screen we could figure that one out alright take care be safe be warm get earmuffs thermal, under thermal underwear and a uh, bunch of blankets and you might have to like make a tent and just go under the tent itself inside your house alrighty please have all your supplies make sure you have supplies alrighty I believe it's a state of emergency up by Buffalo in New York and some of the other states above us keep watching the weather channel and I'll try to give you some news updates be safe that's all I can say be prepared keep your animals in and I'll see you tomorrow on the flip side. Alrighty, then stay tuned. I'm attaching stuff. And then you can watch the stuff after this video that have I have put up under recent uploads. Alrighty then. Oh, come on! Let's get this over with.